Kelly, we're live here just off of Stagecoach Road where firefighters are pretty much in mop-up mode at this point. Uh, they tell me that uh, um, the so-called Stagecoach fire is now contained. I'm going to step out of the way here just for a moment because we've got some vehicles coming down the roadway here. But if you take a look at this video, um, they now tell me that it charred between 20 to 40 acres in the Diamond 20 Ranch Estates area. That is a community that is right off of Highway 4 and Horseshoe Road. Cal Fire now tells me that the structure you saw burning in the aerials captured by Dave Allen in Livecopter 3 was in fact a residence. News of that home burning prompted neighbors here to check on other homes in the community of friends who were out of town. Uh, it had me scared because I live close and this is pretty dry out here. <laughs> so, uh, and I raise olive trees. Olive trees will ignite uh, pretty easily, you know, so. I was a little worried, but I'm not worried now. They, these guys are on their job. They're, they are wonderful. They're on it. Now, the bulk of the activity is now focused on the Pacheco fire. That's where we saw a plane dropping fire retardant on the flames earlier this afternoon, as well as a helicopter doing bucket drops on a hillside right off of Lanford Pacheco Road. At last check, no homes were threatened in that fire. But as you can see, both fires have now scorched more than 250 acres. Cal Fire tells me that they've got someone currently walking the area here at the Pacheco fire, and that number could easily climb up to 280 acres between the two fires. Reporting live here in Calaveras County, Linda Muma, KCRA 3 News.